but he couldn't fit it, so that's unfortunate. Yeah. Um, and Crazy Halo, I'm sorry, but uh, I'm a fraud. Also, the names and uh, everything has to be switched. All right. All right. So uh, we have. Artillo's got it. So we ended up having Ice Light and MOGF. That's MOGF. definitely Marth. Oh, yeah. Definitely Marth. Marth uh, buffed up a little bit. He's buffed yeah. Marth now. He's Smash 4. Yo, Marth is just going. Uh, he's going nowhere right now. Yeah, Marth has some weird moves, man. Um, all right, so I'm leaving after this game. I wanted to commentate for oh, the set, but that's cool. That's all right. I'll, I'll trash talk in your honor. No. Yeah. <laughs> so, nice up tilts by MLGF. Can't so, he went, he's taking Icy Light, just carrying across the stage. Yo. Now, what we're going to need to figure out is what Ice Light's going to do um, to seal this dock. Because on Ike, I mean, she can combo punch any character. Yeah. But she's going to have to catch Ike first. I mean, shit, he's pretty damn fast. Yeah, uh, it's definitely uh, interesting. Mm. Nice what, back air. What she can do is she's back air long enough. Oh, my God. He went, wow, for wall. he went for the wall jump cheese, and he came for it. I mean, it's MLGF. Are you surprised that he went for the wall jump? No. <laughs> No. That is MLGS bread and butter. Like he'll, if he he'll wakes do up wall in the jump morning. in the forward air and make it back somehow, and it pisses me off. <laughs> like he he wakes up in the morning. His mom's like, "Hey, honey, you want some toast?" He's like, "Yeah, put some wall jumps on there, man." Like, come on. Like, he eats that shit for breakfast. All right, so uh, I'm officially banning wireware for as long as I live. <laughs> <laughs> and you went back there too. Like, you're I like, was, "This is a great really idea." I'm like, "All right, I shouldn't lose this." And then it was last stop, last hit. I'm like, "Oh my god, yeah. fuck me." So I just like end up taking stealing a quick stock right there. I see um, play, um, he's getting MLG up with the DI mix-ups on the throws. Yeah, which is pretty much all she does. Yeah. That's what she needs to do. Um, especially in a, like, Ike hits you once or twice, and you're pretty much the exact same percent after your, like, three combos. Yeah, Ike is cheese. Yeah, Ike's pretty good. <laughs> but, um, for those of you who don't know, we had a new PR come out today. Icy Light's actually third, and MLGF, I believe, is fourth. Well, it's definitely showing. So, we're gonna, yeah, we're, we're gonna see the difference right now. MLGF coming up, like he was fifth last season, went up a whole stock. Or a whole uh, a whole spot. Yeah. Spot stock, same thing, whatever. Yeah, same thing. I don't like oh, no. I can attack at ledge with side B and make it back still. I don't like yeah. that. I mean it, oh it's gosh. definitely I just like just walling him out with needles right now. Oh. That's one thing like I, I trained with 6am a little bit, because uh, I was having trouble with Ike. He's yeah. like, if you're having trouble with Ike approaching you, there should always be something in front of you at that point. Especially because I play Diddy Kong, so he's just like, put something in front of you that Ike's gonna run into. And that's exactly what he's doing. Throwing out needles, make him run into them all Yeah, over. like as Yoshi, you just throw eggs and just, it's like, oh, it's just, oh, he gets hit, pops up. Yeah. It's like, do I have a projectile? Yes. Is it in front of Ike? No, you're dead. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, nice like up a stock, you nice like down tilt fair. Uh, I, I, I respect the wall jump on side B. Yeah. That's one thing though, is like MOGF does it a lot, but he also mixes it up a decent amount, where he, it's hard to figure out when he's gonna do it. Yeah. Like a stage like this, he's definitely not gonna do it a lot. But like WireWare, he'll do it every time. Oh, he's, he's got a giant time. wall. It's like, yeah. I can't miss. <laughs> like, if I miss, there's something wrong with me. Yeah. So, I saw just looking to seal his stock out. MOGF was looking to take another stock. I believe I'll be up. Maybe he'll, uh, he can turn this around. It's, uh, it's Ike. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's already at 80%. But he's, again, as soon as he uh, sees him charge up that thing, uh, yeah. charge up the quick draw, uh, that's needle. Back here. All right, Zubat's right. going to get kicked off commentary. All right, man. Good luck, Hunt's man. On. No more WarioWare, okay? No more WarioWare. <laughs> we need you in Grand Finals or something. Like, at least the top. All right. So we're going to end up having Lyric John on me. What's going on? Oh my god, I look awful. You look great. I look awful. What are you saying? Hey guys, uh, Lyric here, obviously. So we have MLGF and Ice Mode. I know. I, two players I, you know. I know, I do know. And I also know this matchup. And so. two players that you can talk a lot of shit about. Pikachu. Oh, the Pikachu. Yep. Okay, so Icy mentioned before to me that he has Pikachu mm -hmm. for Kais. He does. He, he, he has certain matchups for Pikachu, like he has to go Pikachu. I don't and know much about Pikachu's moves, but I would, I'm would i surprised that he picked this stage because I can wall jump on this stage. Yeah, um, I think he obviously he switched from Sheik because Sheik doesn't really benefit from a ton of room, especially against Ike. But Pikachu kind of does. Pikachu's really fast, got some uh, great walling out moves. Yeah. And worst case to worst, he has neutral. Beam, so. Yeah, definitely. But Ice, or Ice, MLJF is showing that this isn't that bad, I guess. I mean, he's not... He's not losing? No, he's not that bad. He's only got, you know, 100%. He cannot make this back. No, he can't. Yeah, I have Pikachu. Um, 
Pikachu, though, it's going to be a little rough because if he does, if, if MLGF throws out any move that's going to beat Pikachu's Nair, which is his approach option, uh, it's going to be difficult. I mean, he can um, quick attack cancel into an up air, but that's also not great when you have a giant sword right there. I still like went for that edge guard there, but uh, MLGF upbeat at the right time, so he couldn't grab the legends. Really smart. No, MLGF's great, especially when he has all the time to stall with the walls. Mm -hmm. He doesn't really give a crap. Yeah. Again, he's he's perfected that. That's so well, the wall jump. I mean, if you ask any, like, up-and-coming Ike who MLGF is, they're like, oh, the wall jump fair guy. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, did, he, did he coin that? Uh, he's more known for that oh, than most it. of the other uh, Ikes. Got it. Got it. Got it. But I yeah, mean, this is pretty close. It looks a lot closer than last game. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Synchronized. <laughs> Nice that, forward smash. I felt that in my soul, that forward smash. Jacob like, is smiling now. He's like, yes, God won. He's like, yep, forward smash. That's all I need. His Ike is just so smooth. Like, all of his combos just kind of work. Like, whenever there's one hit, there's always another hit after. Yeah. You know what I compliment him on now is that he... Um, wow, that was amazing. He went for the dare. They both went fell into the fall zone, but both of them lived. They both wall jumped, too, to get back. Yeah, that was, it was pretty cool. cute. It was like some DB, DBZ stuff. Oh, yeah. I don't agree with the down smash, but... Well, Works, works. Yeah, it kind of works, but he'll still make it back. Oh, okay. yeah. 119% nice, though. Yeah. It's not that bad. He's looking a little frustrated, but I think... I think he just kind of did this to mostly figure it out. Uh, he'll get the stock here. Yeah. yeah. Now, one thing I like to do, and I like to compliment MOGF on, is that he's incorporated the, uh, the quick draw into wave dash back. So he'll quick draw towards his enemy, and he'll just immediately wave dash back. And it's, it psychs people out so much. You have no idea what they're going to do. It just adds a third layer of depth to crit draw. Yeah. Which is crazy. And it's working here a little bit uh, against Isolite. Yeah. If Isolite loses this game, do you think he's going to go back to Sheik, or is he going to stay punch? He might just pick Rob or something. Oh, that's honest. true. He does have a Rob. His Rob is pretty good, too. Um, but we'll see. If he can at least get down the last stock, I'll be pretty happy with how this picture turned out. Which, at this point, um... That was a beautiful back there. And that was an I upbeat. don't know what that upbeat was, but I'm sure it was meant to grab a ledge. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that, too. <laughs> I'm just gonna go with that one. Ooh, in the nice. back air. Was that back air? I thought it was, like, a weird angle of up air. Oh, it was back air. Alright, I'm wrong. I mean, Sorry. maybe. I don't know. And MLGF actually only lost one stock to Ice. Like, all the other ones were pretty much him doing SD. something. Awesome. Yeah. So... Now it's all up to Isolate. Well, he's he's gonna pick. Yeah, I think he's gonna go back to Sheik. The Sheik has the better results. I think so. I think on a larger stage he doesn't want to go Sheik though. That's no. why he switched to Pikachu. Yeah. Sheik has no benefit on a, on a big stage like Delphi yeah. does. Yeah, I agree. Um, like her needles actually don't even cover the majority of the stage. Yep. So who cares? Mm -hmm. um, Let's see the switch. I I know there's gonna be a switch. Oh yeah. It's gonna be the rod. Or, what? No. Oh no, that's, that's Jacob. Oh, that's Jacob. 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 I was confused Isn't he too. Is he locked in though? Technically, like he's locked into character. If Icy doesn't say anything, he'll just do it. I mean, he's technically locked into character. Technically, yes. Technically, he, he cannot switch. I demand that someone tell him that he is locked in his character. That is against the rule. T O T O T O T O. Someone give me a T O here. Okay, so he went Rob. Not yep. surprised. Oh, Smasher, which is I think Rob Meta Knight is more than Rob's favorite. Really? You think so? I, that's that's my personal thing. I don't know how it looks like on paper, but. I think the the top is a huge, um, huge part in this matchup. That and the fact that his down tilt and crouch cancel potential. Uh, I think first like seven. Rob is, yeah. is super aggro, which not a lot of Robs are. They like to use their top and run around. But I see like with all of these combos in the beginning. He pretty much just uses the top. Like he puts it out there. That's like, like right. a zoning technique. He's like, you can't approach now. And yeah. then if someone's off stage, he's like, great, I have the top. Here it is. Throw it at you. All over. And it's kind of like the same way with uh, Zelda's uh, Dense Fire. Yeah, it's just like you a can kind of like You can also like condition your opponent to uh, go into kind of like whatever you want because, you know, you have that space there, that hitbox. But that beautiful F smash is going to take first stop. Yeah. Now, I see has like six jumps to detect that, so he doesn't matter how many jumps he has. He beat up the game real quick with that Nair. Uh, I, like, I know a lot of people like to call Meta Knight's edge guard potential. Uh, baby's first edge guard. Baby's first edge guard. Great. So uh, drop down Invincible Nair. Got it. Super uh, good, cute. Good job, kid. You're learning how to edge guard now. I just but, can't get over how like aggro Icy Light is right now. I mean that that uh, boosted fair is insane. Yeah. I and it combos in so much. But Meta Knight's hitboxes are kind of extreme. Like yeah. his Nair. 
he, super, super out there. Like, his sword is actually, um, it's like a Marth sword, kind of, but just small. So he doesn't have a hitbox on his sword. Yeah. But, it, again, it's just it's tiny. It's, it's cold in it, it, Smash, but it's just tiny, it's all. Um, so that's the only issue with it. It's not great at zoning out, but he has great neutral buttons. The I, side B to get back on stage was interesting. Yeah, um, Meta Knight, if you ever see him, him trying to recover is a struggle in himself when he's really? not he's jumping. That's true. <laughs> like, his, his tornado is like a last ditch resort. His side B is like, all right, I'm getting to the point where up B is probably not great. I'm out of jumps. <laughs> like, it's just weird. I see, like, oh my god, these, these movements. Yeah, that's one great thing about Rob. You can just mix up where you're coming from. Ooh, that was nice. Top into the fair hit. Yeah, that, that would definitely. Can't tell if calculated or actually wanted it. To make Isolate look like he really should be number three on the PR, we're gonna say it's totally calculated. Oh, it's totally, totally calculated. Totally calculated. One hundred percent. I'm super impressed though, because MLGF is actually keeping it quite close. Ooh, that yeah, that's gonna kill. Yeah, there we go. Well, apparently, that Nair's gonna kill. All right. <laughs> Not what I was expecting, but yeah. he ends up hitting with a raw F smash. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen Icy like grab a lot, and I think it's because Emily is spending a lot of time just not near Rob. He's also spending a lot of time in air. True. And airing. And Ooh, it's ooh the anime slash just gets. Is that what they call it? That's what I like to call it. The anime slash. I mean, it's so dramatic and over the top. It's like it feels like you should yeah. fade to black for like a, a you know, anime episode. It's like kind of like Meta Knight's brawl final smash, like the yeah. Darkness. Ooh, darkness. Yeah. Ooh, and then the uh, classic MLGF air dodge, and he's popping off. He's going off with his. He's music anime. Now. MLGF he is. is so anime. Have you met Takashi? I have. Okay. I've known Takashi for a very long. Time. I was gonna say because like. On terms of anime, it's like MLGF and Takashi is just like a tiny bit above him. Like they're both just I like such I used to play anime. anime fighting games when I got out of bracket for him. Anyway, okay. so uh, I see like took complete advantage <laughs> of this. Yeah, that was really good dash dads into uh, down throw. And then he's got MLGF on the ropes right now. I mean, MLGF can bring this back if he gets a couple of hits with yep. that. There's the Nair. And use all the gas. Oh. Oh, it's not go. fair. It's so like it looks like it's hitting so lightly, but it's it's I mean, actually helping him a lot. It's a big robot arm, man. Those big robot arms hurt a lot. Um, well, I don't agree with that side B, but that was a little error I tossed on the on the uh, yeah. top there too, which is cute. Do you think he's just gonna? Oh, that might be good. Here's the grab, finally. Yeah, that's gonna, that's gonna kill. Him. Oh, not yet. I'm a liar. Thanks, Emily. You. You're a liar. Just give me off the mic. I'm done. Well, I don't agree with the dimensional cape, but if MLGF was, or if Icy Light was on that a little bit more, I feel like he could have gotten something. Yeah, I think I'm trying to catch him I off guard. I don't agree with this. The anime it's kind slash of like man. a YOLO type thing. Oh, there it is. He finally hits, but it doesn't kill yet. He's at 187, too. Like, he's got a plate. Back oh, no. here? He's okay I kind of like how, how Icy Light is recovering low. He got hit there, but I feel like that would have. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, here we go. 200? He's getting to 200, which is interesting. Met oh, and that's There it is. All right. 2-1. That was good. I feel like the SD kind of rocked him. Yeah. Ego, K, hi. Apparently oh, you're adorable. You. 